Okay, so today I was out rotating my tires and I found myself frustrated trying to figure out where, uh, how to get the spare out, how to get assemble the pieces for the uh, jack, where to find the lift points. So in this video, I'm gonna throw all that together to you in a very quick video that shows you everything you need to know to change your tire. So first, let's get to the location of the jack. The jack is located behind the passenger side rear door, rear seat. It is right here. One thing to note, and it has it labeled on here, you have to slide it to the left to get it to come out. So slide it to the left, and there's a strap on it. You undo that strap, slide it to the left, pop it out. And that's how you get the jack out. I have no idea what this is. It looks like a funnel. If somebody knows what it is, let me know. Now we're going to disassemble this. Kind of try to remember what you're doing here. This Velcro pops out, this strap, and this pops out. This is Velcroed. It comes apart and lifts off, so this piece is going to go back over top of this. In here, you've got the piece with the tire wrench on it. And then you've got three pieces here, the hook, and these have little push buttons on them. And the push button goes in there. You assemble this, and you're going to get the get it all in there. You're going to take the hook off for now. You're going to take the hook off for now, and assemble it. And you're going to ultimately leave one long, the wide end exposed and you're going to use that to get to your spare tire to get to the spare tire you will need your car key pop this down stick the key in turn it slides out leaves a hole you're going to stick the fat end in and the key here this is what frustrated me i was trying to go straight in naturally you want to go in at a slight angle go up over top of the tire and it'll latch in very easily once you go in at that angle that's key you're going at an angle towards the middle of the truck once you have that you're gonna take you're gonna push the push pin in you're gonna slide that in it'll lock into place with the tire iron and you are going to turn it counterclockwise and that'll drop your spare tire just keep turning it until you have enough slack to let it sit on the ground and you can reach under and uh, pull the puck out by having the slack go down and turn the puck vertically and pull it straight out of the center of the tire. So that's how you get access to your spare tire. From there, you just need to know where your lift points are. The lift points on the back are right in line with the axle on the tire, and so you're gonna wanna put the jack perpendicular to the axle, sliding in from the back. There'll be a little slot on there, and you'll see it very, very easily. Loosen the nuts on the tire slightly before you jack it up off the ground. Make sure you engage your parking brake. Also, when jacking up the back end, you will need the full length of the rod because the jack is so far under. So that's why this thing is so long. And then on the front, the lift point is on the frame itself, just behind the tire, kind of like where it is on, uh, normally on cars where it'll have that lift point there on the frame. It's just a little further under. It'll actually have an arrow pointing to that lift point. So again, you're gonna stick the uh, jack in there uh, perpendicular to that lift point and jack it up. Once you know where all of those things are, the process is actually fairly simple. And I'm hoping that this quick video is gonna save you guys a lot of the frustration that it caused me. If you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and check out some more of our videos. Thanks for watching.